you talked about spirituality and one of the things I wanted to talk to you today about was how, what's the relationship between spirituality and religion? Because a lot of people in the world fear things like yoga and meditation because they see it as religious or... Well, religion usually has to do with the belief system, mm -hmm. with, has to do with uh, ideology, dogma, rituals, uh, sort, certain kinds of uh, practices that are all part of a religion. So spirituality, on the other hand, has things that are common to all religions. Okay. Transcendence, which means getting in touch with that which is beyond space and time. The emergence of platonic values like truth, goodness, beauty, harmony, love, compassion, joy, mm -hmm. equanimity, and the loss of the fear of death. Now that's a common experience which you can call a religious experience. But it's common to all religions. Right. So spirituality is more universal in that it doesn't have boundaries. It respects all religions and yet transcends them because it encompasses the truth of all religions. You know, all religions say you have to love your neighbor as yourself. Right. Right. You have to be loving, compassionate. You have to forgive. You have to get in touch with your inner silence. Mm -hmm and on and on. So spirituality is all those things, but not as a belief system or as dogma, but something that happens quite naturally right. to you when you get in touch with your soul. Mm 